Hello everybody, my name is Dylan and today I'm going to be giving my thoughts on The Rise of Skywalker. I want to say The Last Skywalker. It's The Last Jedi and The Rise of Skywalker, Dylan. And there'll be spoilers just so you know, so let's get on into it. Okay, so with this last movie, I guess a lot of people didn't like it. I really, really enjoyed it. And Palpatine coming back, though, I don't know how I feel about that. Rey being a descendant of Palpatine, I kind of like that they did that instead of, I don't, I was not expecting it for sure. But bringing him back, I don't know about all that. Um, that just seems kind of like cheat code to me. Um, but other than that, I did love seeing Kylo Ren's journey finally make its full circle and to Ben Solo, I think that's what people call him, but, and y'all, I was into Ray and Ben, absolutely. Okay, but then he had to pass, unfortunately, but that was a, a sacrificial moment where he I kind of, you know, gave basically his life to Ray. but, um, Ray is awesome. I don't know why people don't like her. Now, the whole Ray saying her last name is Skywalker at the end, I know a lot of people had issues with that. I don't necessarily have an issue with it, but I also don't, like, love it. Um, I understand why she did it, though. But why do I kind of want her to say Ray Organa? I don't know. I, I did like that Leia was her master in the end and that it did show them, like, her and Luke, like, training as Jedi. I love that. I feel like that needs to be um, explored more. Sorry, my nephews are so loud. I asked them to be quiet, but they don't listen to me. Okay, sorry, my nephew is full on crying out there. So if you hear that he's calm down a little bit, I tried to wait as long as I could, but I want to film. Anyway, um, I forgot where I was. Oh, I'd like maybe a show that would focus on like Luke and Leia training. I thought that was really cool. Um, because we're not like super shown Leia, I feel like, using the Force or tapping into it much until this last trilogy. Oh, uh, and that's kind of it. So, I would like some more of that, okay? But, um, I, I, I love this trilogy, y'all. I loved it. And I don't, I don't find her saying that she's Rey Skywalker that problematic, because she was trained by them, right? She didn't really have family. And... I don't know, because she could say Ray Palpatine or whatever she is, because her parents were good people, even though they descended from Palpatine. That is, See, that doesn't even really make sense to me. So he had a hidden child? Did we know that Palpatine had kids? I don't really know. And she's only his granddaughter. So it's not even that long of a generational thing. Anyway, so I don't know if I like the Palpatine thing, but I did like how she kind of got up and defeated him, even though if it didn't make too much sense. Um, but other than that, because at this point, y'all, I'm tired of the Resistance just getting their booties whipped. So to see them win and everybody finally come and help them was beautiful, but also like, excuse y'all for not coming in the other movie. Other than that, though, I loved the last trilogy. Um, I loved the characters. Um, Finn, even though I felt like they were pushing like a Ray and Finn type thing, I think Ben and Ray made sense, but Ben is no longer with us, unfortunately. So I don't know. And Ro the way Rose was completely disregarded and pushed back in this film, allegedly I heard because people didn't like her. I thought was a disservice to her character. And I think that her and Finn really could have had more of a growth but i did like that new character who's with finn a lot at the end um so i hope to see more with these characters i think they're coming out with a movie with daisy ridley so i hope the other characters are in it but i loved it this is my favorite trilogy in the series sorry if that's problematic but it just was i feel like it was the best written so yeah and i really liked kylo ren's arc actually um it was it was nice it was refreshing and now at this point the jedi temple's destroyed hopefully the jedi and the sith is just squashed because really i feel like without the jedi you couldn't make a sith because y'all's rules are giving them this fear and all this stuff then they want power jedi 
it just was problematic. So I think that's the point they're trying to make. Um, Cause at least Ray, so Ray is like, I don't think Ray has a, a enemy at this point. Like, right? They're supposed to be, oh my gosh, my arm, I'm so sorry. <laughs> they're supposed to be good and they're supposed to be bad to balance the force. But maybe let's just stop using the force so much. I don't know, we'll see. I'm sure it'll happen again at some point. But yeah, so those are my thoughts. Um, let me know down in the comments how do you feel about The Rise of Skywalker. I loved it. Uh, like and subscribe because it really helps me. And I'll see you next time on my next My Thoughts On video, which I think is slated to be my thoughts on Bad Batch Season 2. Which I actually haven't even started at the point of filming this because I'm pretty ahead with my video. So see you then. Bye. It's me, Ipil. Hope you enjoyed the video. <laughs>